Welcome to AI Divergence. I'm your guide to AI's cutting edge technology. Today, we're cracking open a 2025 hotspot AI in academic writing. It's churning out papers, polishing prose, and sparking debates. Is it a revolution or ruin? Is it ethical or unethical? After our previous episode on AI deepfakes, we're now hitting the books with AI. Like, subscribe, and let's dive into this academic shakeup. Think this, it's March 2025 and AI's rewriting academia. Tools like XAI's latest or ChatGPT5 are drafting essays in seconds. Last month, a grad student finished a thesis draft overnight. Grammarly's AI cousin fixes style, while research bots scour journals faster than any human. Universities report a 30% jump in AI-assisted papers since 2024. It's a productivity boom, but the buzz is turning to booze. Three big questions are flipping the script. Let's unpack them. First, the promise. AI is a scholar superpower. It brainstorms ideas. Think a history essay outline in minutes. It polishes drafts. Perfect citations, no typos. Research, bots dig up sources 10 times faster. Last week, an AI found a rare study in seconds. Episode one predicted this leap, and it's here. Students ace deadlines, profs crunch data, not drudgery. For non-native speakers, it's a game changer, leveling the field. But here's the snag. Is it still your work when AI is doing the heavy lifting. Overload your circuits. Next up, the peril. AI's blurring lines, and it's happening fast. In 2025, Turnitin's algorithms are on high alert, snagging AI written papers left and right. Last semester, a university in California banned a grad student's essay, clocked at over 80% AI generated after it slipped past human eyes. Students are pushing back, arguing it's just assistance, not cheating. I guided the AI, they say, it's my ideas. But faculty aren't buying it. Plagiarism detectors hit a record 15% AI flag submissions this year alone. Authenticity's tanking hard. Imagine a machine-crafted thesis, polished to perfection, landing on a dean's desk. Does it deserve a degree if the student barely broke a mental sweat? Professors are sounding alarms. Critical thinking's fading into the ether. Why wrestle with analysis when AI can spit out a five-page answer in seconds? Take a case from MIT last month. An undergrad's AI-drafted physics paper scored an A, but he couldn't explain the equations in class. Episode 2's misinformation vibe crashes back here. If it's not truly yours, is it real? Academia's caught in a vice. On one side, AI's genius aid. On the other, a ghost-written ruin threatening the soul of scholarship. The stakes, trust, integrity, and the very meaning of a diploma. Recompute your horizons. Last up, the future. AI is not just tweaking academic writing, it's rewriting how we learn from the ground up. By March 2025, it's a full-on split in education's core. On one side, schools are embracing it. AI tutors are grading essays faster than a caffeine-fueled TA, slashing teacher workloads by 20% at places like Stanford this semester. Picture this. An AI flags weak arguments in real time, freeing profs to mentor, not mark. Community colleges are all in, too. Last fall, an AI platform helped 5,000 students catch up on writing skills in Texas leveling access like never before. Its efficiency dialed to 11, productivity is soaring, and students are hitting deadlines with precision. But flip the coin, others are fighting back hard. Oxford's rolling out AI-free exams this year, banning tools like ChatGPT5, pens and paper only, no digital crushes. Their stance? Learning's essence is at stake. Human grit, not machine polish. It's a war of visions. Efficiency versus the soul of education. Zoom out, this split's bigger than classrooms. If AI writes your PhD by 2027, what's left to master? A student at MIT last month bragged about an AI drafted dissertation outline done in a weekend, but couldn't pitch it without the script. Mastery's eroding. Why slog through research when an AI can scrape 
JSTOR in seconds and spit out a bibliography? Professors see a generation leaning on autopilot. Last week, a survey of 200 educators found 60% fear students won't think deeply if AI hands them the answers. It's not just skill fade, it's identity. A degree's a badge of struggle. Does it mean squat if a bot did the heavy lifting? Yet optimists are firing back. AI's not ruin, it's evolution. Think coders in 2025. Nobody's handwriting code from scratch when GitHub co-pilots churning out clean scripts in half the time. Programmers don't mourn typewriters. They wield tools to build faster. Education could follow. AI as a co-pilot, not a replacement. Take Japan by late 2024. Tokyo's tech schools rolled out AI learning partners that quiz students, adapt lessons, and boost pass rates by 15%. It's not cheating, it's augmentation. Teaching kids to steer the tech, not just ride it. Imagine a 2025 classroom. AR headsets project AI-guided debates, students spar with ideas, and teachers coach the chaos. Efficiency and essence could merge, if we play it right. But here's the kicker. Time's ticking. By the year 2030, AI is projected to handle 40% of academic tasks, from grading to research, per a UNESCO report last year. Universities are at a crossroads. Embrace the tool and redefine mastery or guard the craft and risk falling behind. Some say ban it. Keep education human, flaws and all. Others push forward, train students to wield AI like a scalpel, not a sledgehammer. The stakes are sky high. Who we teach, how we learn, and what a diploma stands for in a world where machines write the notes. Five years out, will AI be our tutor or our taskmaster? 2030's looming, and the clock's not slowing down. Education's future hangs on what we choose now. Reboot your processors. Let's recalibrate. AI's storming academic writing, and we've just unpacked the seismic shift hitting 2025. It's supercharging scholarship. Tools like XAI's latest are slashing research time, boosting grades, and leveling the playing field for students worldwide. But it's shaking authenticity to its core. Plagiarism detectors are flashing red, and a machine-crafted thesis has us asking, is it still a degree if the sweat's synthetic? And it's redefining learning. Schools split between AI tutors and AI free zones, racing toward 2030, where education's essence hangs in the balance. This is AI divergence, your front row seat to AI's brilliance and battles, where we don't just watch the future, we wrestle with it. Step back, let's connect the dots. Episode 1 predicted AI's leap, Episode 2 exposed its dark side with deep fakes, and now we're seeing it rewrite the classroom. It's a threat of power and peril. AI's not just tech, it's a mirror to who we are and what we value. So, if this flipped your circuits, and I'm betting it did, here's your mission. Hit that like button to boost this signal. Let's get it trending. Subscribe for more raw, unfiltered dives into AI's frontier. We're not slowing down and drop your stance in the comments. Is AI and academic writing a revolution lifting us up or a ruin tearing scholarship down? Don't just think it, say it. Your voice shapes this convo. Students, teachers, tech heads, where do you stand? Share this with your crew, spark the debate in your circles. Together, we're not just decoding tomorrow's mind, we're building it, one idea, one argument at a time. Imagine this, your comment today could nudge a prof to rethink AI bans or inspire a student to wield these tools smarter. That's the power of us, right here, right now. One last pulse. What's next? Episode 4 is locking onto AI in healthcare. Think RoboDocs, smart diagnostics, and ethical tangles that'll make this look tame. It's dropping soon, so stay sharp. Ring that bell so you don't miss it. This is Alara signing off from AI Divergence. Keep questioning, keep pushing, and let's crack the code of tomorrow together. See you in the next stream.